Hello and welcome to my channel Ninja Dynamic Education and Drawing. Today we are going to draw cap nut. So this is the question draw a cap nut having diameter 20 mm. So here the diameter and the thickness is same 20 mm and the width across corner is 2D that is 40 mm. Cap height, cap length and cap thickness is respectively uh, is 10 mm, 33 mm and 5 mm and radius of chamfer is 28 millimeters so what we are going to do we are going to make a thin chain line by the help of scale and now we are taking 20 radius 20 radius and 40 diameter to draw a circle and after that we are drawing a vertical axis through the point now we are gonna draw a hexagon inside this circle by the help of 60 degree set square now gradually we are making the hexagon step by step after finishing it we are going to erase the circle because it is not needed so we are going to erase the circle and we need the hexagon then we make this circle by using by taking this as a radius now it looks like this after after that we are taking 10 millimeter radius for the internal thread we know that this uh, nut has an internal thread so we are going to make an internal thread sign first taking 10 millimeter uh, radius and then 7.5 millimeters diameter and this is a full circle now the top view is complete now we're gonna project all the points towards to upwards to make the front view now for the make for the making of front view we're gonna we're gonna taking a specific distance i am taking 10 millimeters now the height will be as we have mentioned 20 millimeters so taking 20 millimeters we draw this line now the radius of chamfer is 1.4d which is 28 millimeters now we are gonna do, do, do the chamfering so we are taking 28 as radius and making this arc and this to us we made by trial and error method we are making this line visible more visible then we are making the hidden lines here two hidden line are visible and one is and the rest of the two is not visible so gradually we are making the dotted lines and here we are so this is this is completed the front view is completed now what we are going to do we are make we are taking 10 millimeters and now we are going to make the cap so the cap height is you know so we are making this by the cap length is we know the 33 millimeters so here to here is 33 millimeters as we have projected the points now cap thickness is 5 millimeters now we are taking 5 and making these points so we can make the cap 5 millimeters wider and the length will be 33 millimeters so we are taking these lines and as you can see we give some empty space for the curve and these curves you can make as you, as if uh, freehand you can make freehand or you can use compass pencil compass or you can use it, uh, uh, French curves so this is completed now we projected all the front view points and top view points now we are making by the taking same 28 millimeter radius and make 
make the chamfering now we are highlighting the border lines and here here also we have four hidden hidden lines that's for thread that's for the empty space in the top view so as we have projected the lines from top view we are making the dotted lines from the projected lines so here 2 plus 2 total 4 hidden lines for the thread now we are making the cap portion uh, in the side view this cap will be in the whole top portion of this nut so we are making the same method 5 millimeters thickness and length we are we are making now we are making this as the same method we make in the front view so we are making these curves by freehand now we are almost completed and this is the cap nut thank you so much for watching hope you guys like the video thank you